I'm shook and welcome back to my channel and um, I, if you watch my I don't even know why I did but today's tutorial is going to be on an eye look that I did over the weekend when I went to a wedding with my best friend Eva she's really amazing I just I uploaded my first vlog ever so you guys can go check it out and so I did this eye look I think I will set it here the next you do for me I got requests from people that I should do a tutorial on it so that's what we are going to do today and also first impressions guys I got this new Ben Eye final seal matte makeup since I have oily skin and also I got this RCMA powder I've been hearing and seeing you know tutorials on it on YouTube here so I wanted to try it out and I got this new ordinary um, what's it called the brightening is too much but yeah it's ordinary primer silicone yeah from the ordinary and then they're really good so without any much further ado i'm just going to start you know the makeup before i forget i got this new beauty blenders from rose using fawn conceal eh, sorry toffee concealer in toffee to back that into my eyelid yeah. i must say it's really oh wow it gets in there guys it really does it gets so much in there so isn't anyone going to compliment about my background? I've got a new background guys, I've got a new background. <laughs> yeah. Oh wow. It really pops in well. It really MA powder guys. RCMA powder in. I'm using the flat side. She said it. Here it goes. It really is great. So I got this um, eyeshadow from Paris Cosmetic, and these are the colors. I'm going with this brown shade here. That's what I used for my crease color. I didn't really do any major, you know, eyeshadow look. I was in a hurry. I was running late, so I didn't do anything major. But yeah, that's what I did. I just put that right in the crease, just right in there. And, um, I blended it out well. Then afterwards, I went in with this this eyeshadow right here. I used this NYX eyeshadow base. So I'm not really cutting my crease. I'm just putting it in there. I just why am I saying a lot of in there today? <laughs> it falls out. It's not. There's not a whole lot of color, but it's fine. Ooh. Oh yes. Oh yes. Okay, I know that sounded really <laughs> silly there, but yeah. If you're going to maybe work with it on a client, then you just have to use a base, a glitter base, because they are little fallouts and you wouldn't want that. So after that, the next thing I did was my eyeliner. I'm using the Essence um, pen liner. Yeah, that's what I call it though, but yeah. I got it from Urban 101. I'll put his link in the description box below. You can find him on Instagram. Yeah, that's how it looks. Oh, forgive me. So I'm going to go right ahead and finish the other eye, put on the lashes, and I'll be back. The ordinary silicone primer. I've used it a couple of times. Um, when I started using it, I wasn't seeing the. I won't lie, I wasn't seeing it. I was just a bit skeptical about it. But if you have great skin, then the great product will be good with it. So, yeah, it's not much like the Rimmel one, like how it will face. Maybe you put it on, you can just see that your face is mattifying, but. <laughs> So it has a little bit of a smooth finishing, RCMA. So let's set our face with it a little bit. The oily areas, because this is very good for oily skin. And I'll end up using the Benai Final Seal Matte Makeup um, Sealer. So we don't want our face to be very, very cakey. This is, oh. <laughs> this is a first impression kind of thing. So, oh. Guys, it's true. You see here, let's see if the shine will go down after I apply it there. <laughs> this, you just saw it. The shine literally went down. It literally, 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 literally went down. Though I put some in my hair, but 
the shine went down so yeah the next thing is the foundation and I'm, I'm doing a new technique I'll show you guys soon I'm doing a new technique but today I'm just go straight ahead and do the foundation oh my god what kind of ratchetness is this local ratchetness I tell you I'm out of a foundation and I'm... your girl needs support though Just a good blender. Hey, girl, concealer in toffee. Oh, my highlight. Can I come into your space? Like, have a good job. Take it slowly. Just hold it. I just have to get this in a bigger size. That's all. <laughs> but it's, it's good for getting into the small areas like my nose right now. It's good for that area. I'll be doing an updated highlight and contour. So you guys should stay tuned. And a new foundation. Routine. Now, let's bake. Ta -da! Have you guys noticed that if anyone is about baking, they do <laughs> it's just a funny face. I went in with this Miss Loretta Jumbo can still I want to love you now you can I contoured with I don't even know why I'm going to say this but I contoured with this black radiance contour palette if you haven't got yours please rush right now and go and get yours okay because it's good i i don't it's, it's good i'm not even going I, I, it's good that's what i'm going to say if you yeah i'll go pay you back one day i use this one the sculpt powder i didn't use this one because it's really dark so i use this one Black Radiance Continuous Color Pigment. It's supposed to be for eyeshadow. But as stubborn as I am to use it as a highlighter. I can see the highlight from here though. It's like I'm coming from Mars. <laughs> Guys, wait, watch this video. The video I'm going to put next is watch it and see. Nobody can compare. You saw in the morning when I used it at 8 a.m. and then when I used it, when sorry, so when I used it, and then after eight and a half hours, that's 4 30 p.m. You saw the effect. It was only my my nose was the only part that got a little bit oily, but aside that, my whole face was mm. see the way my bones were sucked in out of my face, so it was snatched. No sweat, no oil. Yeah, but the nose will kind of. It has a minty feel. And immediately you spray it on, you can't even see anything. Can I can see there's no flash that it's like skin. Ugh. I'm done. I 
think today I really talked a lot in my video. You guys should forgive me. I'll never do that again. <laughs> So for the Benai, you saw the video. So I'm sure you guys know it. I've already said a whole lot about the RCMA powder. You guys should see. It feels like skin. It's so smooth. So smooth. Will I continue using it? Yes. I think it's going to be my holy grail for now. But let's see how it turns out. The ordinary, you guys should get it. Um, if you have oily skin, I advise you get it, and then you get this one as well, the Benai. The two, when I used it, it goes hand in hand. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions or suggestions, just leave it down in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, hit the subscribe button, and there's a bell next to the subscribe button. Hit on it so that whenever I upload a video, you'll be the first to know. I love you guys, and I'll see you in my next one. So, ciao, better. Ciao, beauties. Ciao, Fela. Ciao. <laughs>